Good morning and welcome to the first ever Mom's Lifesavers how-to video. Today we're going to be making paracord flip-flops. Really simple, really fun, and easy to make with your, um, your young ones. Paracord comes in all kinds of colors, camo of every color you can imagine, um, boys colors, girls colors, and uh, all we did was pick up a basic pair of flip-flops and embellish them with the paracord. And I'm going to show you how. Things that you're going to need inexpensive pair of flip-flops. We grabbed ours at the Dollar Tree. Yes, for one dollar. Um, paracord. You can find it like this at your local craft supplies store, okay? Uh, the big ones, they've got it in all sorts of colors. This one here is a rainbow, red. Um, if you have an outdoor or sporting goods or army surplus store nearby you, uh, you can buy larger quantities in um, not quite as many colors, uh, but a nice variety nonetheless, but again, larger quantity. For uh, today's purposes and what we're doing, all you really need is what you can pick up at your, um, your basic store, okay? Let's put one of those aside, and let's start by figuring out how much paracord we need to, to do this, all right? What you want to do is start with your paracord and just measure around your flip-flop, okay? So there's one length around the flip-flop. And this is just going to give you a ballpark figure of what you need. You want to take this and multiply it six times. So there's two, three, four strands, five strands, and six strands, okay? Anything extra, you can just trim off. But that gives you... That gives you a ballpark of the amount you're going to need for one flip-flop. Now what I want you to do is take the two ends, fold it in half, and find that center point. Okay, that center point is going to be our starting point. Center point is going to go underneath the base of the flip-flop right here. You're going to pull it through. So this is what you've got. Okay, your center doesn't have to be exact. And then your two ends. All right. We're going to cross over that first end, making that shape, and putting this one on top of it, and simply pulling it through. Okay, That's your first part of your knot. What you want to do is make sure you follow these little nubs. See that little nub right there on the end? That means, that signals to you that this is the side you start on next. Okay, So now you put this one over, across like this. This piece right here will lay on top and then you're going to pull it through here. Okay, Tighten it up and now you're going to see that that nub has now moved over to this side. Okay, Get That close enough right there. Now this means this is the side we're going to start on next. So it's basically a really simple pull through, tighten, and you're going to alternate side to side. Again, nubs over on this side now. So now we're going to cross over that one here and pull through. And it doesn't change. You're going to keep going this way, creating this pattern of back and forth and back and forth all the way down the flip-flop till you get to here. And then you're just going to turn it and you're going to keep it going all the way down to that side. All right, really simple. Simple, uh, simple knot here. We also have step-by-step -step, uh, photo instructions if that helps you out too. And you can find those on our blog at momslifesavers.blogspot.com. So here what we're going to do now is I'm going to just, for the sake of video and timing here, I'm going to cut these off here and show you how to end it just like you would here on the end of the finished product. All right. Sharp scissors, always helpful, great tool. Cut that piece off there, and we're going to do the same on this side. Okay. This part, you want to have a nice lighter. Um, I like the longer ones because I don't want it to heat up near my fingers. And you're going to heat that end up. You'll see that the paracord center will actually start to melt, and then I use the lighter to just kind of push that in. Push that down a little bit. Obviously, this is the part I don't recommend to let the kids do. Um, this is something that you should be doing. And what this does is it just seals and closes that knot up by melting it just a little bit. Push that right there. And now that knot is uh, locked in place. Okay. 
So let's get back here to our finished product. I hope you guys like it. Um, if you have any questions, leave us a comment. Let us know. We hope this video helps you get creative this summer and uh, get to use those flip-flops out on the beach or the lake someplace. You can find Mom's Lifesavers pretty much everywhere nowadays. Uh, we are on Twitter, Pinterest, uh, Facebook, and LinkedIn. Uh, you can also go to our website, momslifesavers.com, and uh, get all of the details and information about our ideas and reviews, uh, products, books, you name it, all those things to help you navigate parenting. Um, we're all in it together. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I look forward to uh, doing another one for you guys shortly. Take care.